something that's um, I'm trying to go. I'm trying to Okay, candlelesson. I am not kidding. Um, if anybody gets here, please, what I've told them, please, I'm telling you the candlelesson. It's, it's um, on the YouTube, and if you don't know, everybody has a different color. You're welcome to email me. Just give me time to respond. You don't need to be in front of me. I do readings all over the world. Um, and I will give you your color. Okay, the time lesson, rule one. And this is something. Who prays in the evening? No offense. What happens when you pray? You bring this wonderful energy in, right? Spiritual energy. And what do you do? You put it in your pillow because you go to sleep. All right? So what I'm saying is go and um, connect in the mornings. Use the benefit all day, all right? So um, I'm not going to point out who's going through depressions, and there are some people who are going to into catastrophic uh, depressions in here. And remember, funks are depressions, and there's a video on depression in um, on the video too, YouTube. So basically, even if you're going on a depression, what I want you to do is get a candle, I'll give you the colors later, and light the candle, and if you're not British, um, you, can, um, you can ask anything and everything. We're not allowed to. Okay. Everything and anything, no restrictions, okay? Now, here come the lethal aspects. There's caveats. Caveat one, if you don't ask, you don't get. All right? You're shaking, but you don't ask, do you? You, you give a lot of, uh, to help people, right? This lady, right? Yes, you but you don't ask yourself. You ask the others, you have to. And they say thank you. So basically, if you don't ask, you don't get. I wanted when my mother transitioned in 2006. She knows I love Lavendines, but do I get one? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not walking, as we call it, but it's called Shanks' pony when you walk in. But no, I didn't get a Lavendine, but I have not. So, okay? So um, basically, if you don't ask, you don't get. Uh, the other one, be careful what you ask for. Okay? I did a cult that fair um, about two or three years ago. And this woman comes and I would love, I want, uh, my husband and I want um, children so badly. I said, great, you're going to have a baby in July. I said, you know, you'll be pregnant in November. She's jumping around, her, all her arms are happy. I said, get back here, I'll finish with you. So she sits down and I said, you know when you have a baby two months later? You're going to be pregnant again. She said, oh my God. Mm -hmm. So what you're doing is also getting, she's getting too much of the same thing. Now she's got two children. So be careful what you ask for. Think about it. All right, second, third thing. Um, in their time, not your time. And that is something that I get faced with a lot of people. Why can't I have it now? Okay, say in this scenario, it life's like a domino. You know, dominoes, set of dominoes, and it's all connected. And you decide to have um, a tantrum with spirit. You're going to have a tantrum with spirit and you're not going to good luck. <laughs> so we're having a tantrum. I want money now or else. And that's another thing. No, no. Okay, or else you're going to threaten them. Fine. Okay, <coughs> we'll give you money, dear. Okay, so they go down nine years, put it in your lap, and you win the lottery. Wow, I got money. Now, how many here know that how many of the people who won the lottery are broke, bankrupt, homeless within less than a year or two? It's because why? They weren't ready for the money. All right? They will get you through things. And it doesn't mean it's just money. Ask for money. I want you to. It's just a tool. It is, that's all it is, a tool. And you have to realize if you don't ask, you don't. Thank you. So basically, if you don't do that, you'll see a lot of things going through. Um, quickly, I'm trying to do okay. it. Oh, second rule. I'd like you to say thank you. You don't need to, but you're asking for something, you might as well say thank you. Last two, it is so important, and this is not a line. And the people who are doing the candle lesson, um, I'm not kidding. You'll see the um, candle flame going into a belly dance. And they, or it gets large. My first lecture was in um, Learning Life in Anaheim about 20 years ago. And 38 heads, I found the candle. My mother had just passed away from cancer. And it was a tiny little candle, red. She loved red. She hates it when I do this. I went back to England to sell the estate. On a 22 um, red shoes and red carpet, red car. She loved red. So anyway, basically, the um, candle was about this big. I turned, and 38 heads had moved around. I was wondering what this and the flame is this high, I'm going to So really, so, um, it was that high, and I'm not kidding, uh, nobody can believe it. They are telling you they're in the room. They are definitely 
um, going into um, not other realms, but they are here, they want to help you and they can help you. Whether you believe or not, they will help you. But you have to believe in that. And you ask and you get. The one on depression is very important, and I'll tie it up here, is really ask to get through the day. And instead of grinding as if daggers are going down you, you get actually floated through the day. You still feel things. Because depression is an excellent thing to be in. Who's noticed that when they come out of depression, huge things start changing in their life? It's a catalyst. So just remember that. And I know I'm going to get kicked out. So anyway, I do thank you so much if you want to. Our website is, um, actually go to YouTube for the videos. The website is on Nathan's. It's www.inspirit.com. Oh, if you can call us, yeah, email me um, with the answer. Almost information.